Yo guys, welcome back to another episode of Soma. I'm happy to see that you're back. Um, last time we left off with entering the suit. So I think this episode we should be going into the abyss. Uh, which will be quite cool I think. I don't really know what to expect. Only deep waters. Um, this might even be the end of the series, I'm not even sure about that. But I guess we'll see. Let's continue. Just a ladder, is it? Oh no, I have to go to that way. Why is everything so scary on the water? Places taken. The real me died like a hundred years ago. Is there still room for me? And what about the Simon I killed at Omicron? What do you think, Catherine? Is there a heaven full of redundant copies of the same people? Is there someone up there who called me an imposter? Why is she not right? talking to us? woke up in the right body. I basically flipped a coin, and if I had called the wrong side, I'd be rotting away at Omicron. I mean, there's nowhere to know, right? You didn't hit the make sure Simon wakes up in the right body switch, did you? Not that you would know. I mean, he would still claim to be the right Simon. Christ. This is awful. We did an awful fucking thing. And you wouldn't mind? Why would you? How could you know that it's not me, the me that I am, the same that I've always been? Let me say something. I don't want to think. Please. I don't like that she's not I don't know what to say. I don't want to upset you. Say anything. When I was little, I used to climb the stairs all the way to the top of the building. And I could still feel how I had to, you know, tuck my arm so I could push the heavy steel door open. Well, the first time that I dared go up there, I stepped out onto the roof and watched the smog rise and fall over Taipei. I got all the way up to the corner ledge and, you know, I felt the warm wind in my hair and the sun was setting and the streets below were shadowed by the tall buildings. 
The people pushing through the crowd flowed like paint from an artist's brush. Street food vendors filled the air oh, with the aromas of all my favorite foods. For a brief moment, I felt connected to the world in a way that I never had before. It was the most profound feeling of comfort and sense of belonging I could ever hope for. I really never felt the same way again, but I went up to the roof many times after. This will take I'm not religious, but I can see why people would be. The privilege of being makes a strong case, at least every once in a while. Do you still feel that sense of awe? Even like this? Things are different, but we're still here. What's the point of going on? Everyone's gone. All the people still left are digital copies trapped in computers at the bottom of the sea. We'll never be able to rebuild or reclaim what we were. Are you really so unhappy being what you are, or is this about the man who went for a scan a hundred years ago? Both, I guess. When I was back in Toronto, even the worst case, the darkest futures I could predict, they at least included my previous life somehow. I feel so uprooted. There's nothing here that I recognize, nothing that makes me feel like I belong. Even if we make it to the Ark, would it be any different? still be alone no friends no family you could make new friends I'm sure everyone would like to know the time traveler if not you still have oh, something had to go wrong Catherine Kath? hello Catherine what happened The power blacked out for a moment. Think it could be the atmospheric pressure. It's pushing pretty hard, really testing the limits of my suit. Don't worry, it should hold. Comforting. It will hold. Does, does time freeze when you're not powered? Time feels omitted more than anything. What's the difference? I don't feel like I'm being held back or hindered. And I don't have the opportunity to reflect on the time I'm missing. It's simply missing. Sounds like sleeping without the dreaming. Yes. But generally you anticipate when you're about to sleep, and there's a natural continuation since we tend to wake up where we went to sleep. My experience is more like an ever-changing moment that never really seems to find closure. Sounds kind of like a movie being edited live. I suppose so. I guess it sounds exciting, but it really keeps me activated to the point of exhaustion. It's rough. Could be worse. Could be a time traveler stuck in a body made from black goo. That'd be the worst. Right. Oh, good, you're back. What happened? Something dropped onto the cage, knocks you right out. It spoke to me. Looks like a man, one of WoW's creatures. It just stared at you for a moment, then threw itself down the abyss. It said it would make preparations. I don't like the sound of that. It was very strange. I thought it was going to kill you for sure. Glad it didn't. Yeah. Me too. Looks like we're closing in on the ocean floor. Good. Not sure the climber can take it much longer. It's so dumb. Okay, so this is the Omega Sector. It's about an acre of the abyssal plan used by Pathos 2. I expect we'll have to do some walking before we reach Tau. You haven't been here before? Not in a way that'll help us. Right. The other you has been here. We're following in your old footsteps, Kat. When I had footsteps. You could still be down here somewhere. Technically. 
Don't remind me, freaks me out. Alright, let's head for town and find that arc. I think that walk will be one long trippy walk. speaking to the lamp lights. They won't go near them. I can't fail, Glasser. God. It's important I reach Omicron. Our future depends on it. Calm down. Let's just follow the path. If I die, I need you to tell Julia Dahl that the WoW is out of control. She needs to get to Sarang. He'll know what to do. Raj, you can tell them yourself. We just need to pick up the pace, okay? Glass! We lost the path! We need to go back! I know where to go. Come on! It's over there! The light is over there! Final push, Ross. Almost there, we just... <laughs>
sounds even come from. Yo, this is like way too loud to be honest. Not that that's going to be much better, but... Ran straight towards that. You can see anything. Shut the 
just keep running. Can't be much longer. This this really looks like end game material. If I ever saw it. Looks like a space station. Let's find the arc. Welcome to Tau. What's left of it? Are you guys alright? What happened here? We ran out of real food long ago. People have been getting sick. Haven't heard from anyone in months. No shit. They all think you're dead down here. Some failed evac story circulating at Omicron. Oh, God. Listen, son. We're on an important mission, and we need your help to operate the Omega space gun. When it's done, we can all head back up the plateau. But now we need to get moving. Of course. Head on through to the habitat. We shut off the front section to preserve power. All right. See you soon. So do... Do I have to get my suit off? Guess not.
wizards. Okay, I did that pretty nicely if I may say so myself. something Wow, 
does my screen keep doing that? different. Go ahead. Make yourself at home. Will do. Don't mind me. No, I'm not minding you at all. Exactly. Nice pictures you have laying around here. Can I help you with anything? No, no, you can't. Let what me just doing? quickly check your computer. What are you looking for? Nice suit. Thank you. Used to have one just like it. Maybe it's yours. And I'll stall it. Oh, restoring. It's a new human. Sarah Lindwall. Payload technician at your service. A rare sight, am I right? I'd say so. You're the first normal living human I've seen. There's not many left down here. Most of them are up on the plateau. You mean at Omicron? Yeah. There's no one alive at Omicron. You've been there? I've been all over. The power plant at Upsilon. The ruins of Lambda. The abandoned Delta, Theta. You've been to Theta? There's not a lot left of Pathos 2. And, uh... I'm 
the only living person you've met? <coughs> you mean I'm the last living human on the planet? I'm sorry. Who are you again? Simon Jarrett. Station down? Nowhere. I, I used to work in a bookshop in Toronto. Long story. Then what the hell are you doing here? I'm trying to find the Ark. Why would you? How do you know about that? I've heard it's the last hope for mankind. Damn right it is. Now what do you want with it? Take it to the gun at Phi. Launch it into space. That was the plan, all right. I've been guarding it ever since we brought it back to town. Ah, that's the Ark right here. I just couldn't bring myself oh, we to have to go. unplug her. Tell you the truth. I don't have the strength to argue. And I certainly don't have the time to wait for the next sentient thing shuffling through here. Go ahead. Take it. Thank you. Can I get you anything? Do anything for you? You could kill me. Good one. Are you serious about me killing you? No, I'd love to hang around here until I dry up to the size of a raisin. Simon, this fucking sucks. <coughs> I don't want to live like this. I'm glad you came by. Good to get this over with. If I knew you'd come, I would have cleaned this place up a little bit. Shouldn't we be doing something to keep you alive? Why? You're the last human. I, I just find it disrespectful to our entire history not to fight this. Sure, we have the Ark, but you're the real deal. Thanks. That's probably the best compliment I've ever got. But the truth is that the Ark is all we have. We'll have to accept second best, you know. One second. This feels right. Son, I want to die. Sarah. Just think about it. Knock it out of the park. All right. Would you stay with me, please? It won't be long now. Just please, just stay. What a crazy thing this was. Life. At least I won't have to turn 30. The Ready. last human alive. Wish I could have died at home with my friends. Could you die a little bit quicker? Have you ever been to <laughs> Greenland? I have uh, a thing beautiful. to launch into space, so... Well, at least when you get out of the city. 
Nanak is busy, and yes, there's like 12 million people trying to get around, but it's a great place. Or rather, it was a great place. Oh, so calm it did this all. all. So maybe also the monsters. You know what? I prefer it this way. I liked Payphones. Liked my colleagues. Ian, Nick, Jasper, even Kat. Even Kat. Uh, don't People talk about Catherine like that. People thought she was because she was quiet. But she was cool. Simon, you still there? I'm here, Sarah. Don't let him die, okay? Send them out there. To the stars. The black box is inactive. Probably found a way to switch it off. Guys, thank you so much for watching this episode of Soma. Please leave a like, subscribe, and I hope to see you in the next episode. Goodbye.